so i would not animate this as i do not want any animation here and i want to adjust this mask the shape of the mask here though in the same way it can be animated as i have shown you earlier anywhere if you want to keep your mask so it's the same thing just is that the shape is different so let us delete this and check the last shape which says free draw bezier so this can be used for rotoscoping a very basic rotoscoping so this basically allows you to draw your mask according to your shape according to the shape you want through this pen tool so this is a very really cool feature but this pen tool is again this option of pen tool is again available in cc 2014 and it is not available in cc 2014 also so from since cc 2015 you will be able to get this tool and you can draw your mask shape as you want you can even modify it so if you see here I am able to modify this by dragging its handles of the anchor points. So if you have even drawn a, your mask, you can also, if you want, you can also modify it by dragging its handles. If you want, you can also delete this. Suppose if you have added, if you go go here, if you can see this plus icon here, so this would create an anchor point here, which through which you can again modify your mask. And suppose if you want to delete any, suppose if I want to delete this or maybe this point, so I would go here and press Control or Command Control on Windows and Command on Mac, and I would click here. So if you see here this the anchor point which was there earlier has been removed. I want one more maybe here and I don't want here so I want it here and I would not again want it here. So these are the ways in which you can create your own shape own mask shape rather than this preset of eclipse and four point polygon masking so in the same way it would add it would add feather if you can see feather has been increased to 58 i want it maybe 120 so the, uh, smooth blending of this has been done here you can see this edges blending has been done or maybe I want its shape to be something like this. So I want here just to reveal this one. And I again, but I do not want this extra water here. And so you can even animate this mask which you have created by clicking your mask path and then again going here and then if you click here again select this mask you'll get the anchor points here now on any frame you can create your mask and adjust it adjust the anchor points according to your choices according to your requirement so let us check the animation of this if you see here if you select the mask path here if you go frame by frame you will notice here is that the mask is animating if you see here this is gradually shifting this anchor point so this mask can be animated by this way if you see here i am playing it in a fast mode the anchor points are shifting. So 
so you can animate any of your anchor point you want or at any at any moment at any time you want anywhere you want same thing it can be get expanded uh, inverted so this is just again a different customized tool which has been provided by premier which creates your bezier mask and allows you to mask your clip according to your need according to your shape so yeah this was our total opacity which covered opacity masking opacity animation with and different shapes provided in opacity masking